Good mini. Horn Dan, how's it going? I hope your curry is delicious. Oops. Too far to the right. different approach this time. Also, I'm very bad at this video game. I don't even know where I'm going. So this time, I'm gonna have fish spawned already up here. But the hope is that I'll be able to take care of these guys fast enough that it's faster than waiting for events. Now, why would a fish evolve lips if not to smile? Don't you feel put at ease by this fish? These fish will just run away from you now, phase of this. Hopefully.
didn't want to go back in. Rathwell, thank you for the good luck. Right, this is probably fine for farming right to the right. Yeah, this is great. Alright, so fighting, definitely slower, um, earlier. Maybe. Alright, so I actually didn't have to like I can I can dump stat wisdom there. That's great to know. I can be the dumbest fish. I don't have to worry about that. Like I have to I have to pay that back here, but
Makes sense that I can be the dumbest fish. All the fish that you have are the dumbest fish. And you still love the shit out of them. Gaia loves a dumb fish. I think that the world just loves it when you look at a fish and you go, that's a dumb motherfucker. How many Monogatari's are we at now? This is the second one.
I just want the desert to stop hurting. Nope, desert still hurts. Yeah, this, this little guy rules. It's so good. Monogatari is Latin for one Gatari. That's correct. Surf Wizard, I didn't know that you were fluent in Latin. That's cool. Sorry, dude, I tried to go around. Yeah, Cole Forest era is definitely very strong when it comes to artwork. to run. You all saw me.
Standing in my way, though. That's what tunnels sound like in real life. Even when I want to avoid a fight. So hard. This spot is gonna max level me, so that's nice. I think. I think this spot gives me enough. There's another one here. No, not enough. That's fine. Oh, we're back to this guy. I'm okay with that. Look at this little guy. He's just having a good day. slower, which, frankly, I'm not going to complain too much about. Leggy, how's it going? Genuinely terrified of the fact that I think there's a Seymouria over to the right. We just dodged him. Never mind. Hate this. They sent a backup just in case. What's up with these spawns, though? Oh, my God. 
That's right, bad room. You got it in one. Not so interested in Seymouria. Really, I'd like to see Lessia. That's... <laughs> everything about this is... Hey, that's enough. I don't need any more, actually. You can, you can hold on to the rest of it. Thank you. Taking a sick day? I'm sorry to hear that. But your cat is... Curled up with you? Hell yeah. Your cat knows what's up. I didn't need to do that second one. The Harry Ocellus is here to sell me car insurance. Yeah, that tracks. 
or more to the point, wants to talk about my extended warranty. Okay, actually, I would love to be in a fight right now so that I could heal. That would be great for me. Thanks for giving me a chance to take a breather. Stop calling about the extended warranty on the car that you totaled five years ago. And I still get those calls and I don't own a car. I never have. That was a bad minute. This blue guy just wants to be a hippo? Yeah, pretty much. Including the part where he will not hesitate to ruin you.
maybe after this farm, it's time to start moving forward? One more. Just give me one more. Please. Thank you. Sometimes you gotta wiggle. think that I can trigger my next evolution form. Oh my god. I don't think that I can. There we go. Yeah, just short. That's fine. Oh no, I'm faster now. This is why people invented speed limits. I'm just gonna hang out as uh as this species for a bit and hopefully that gives me a chance to grind a little bit Italy I'm in a good enough spot to be able to take the fights up ahead. Good news about my ability to take these fights. 
think I'm gonna do okay. Oh, that moved me down. Need more defense. Ariaradron looks like the pet of a Disney villain. Was that the one that came before this one? Or is it the... Uh... I, I've, I've been thinking of the one that I think you mean as more like 
henchman-like almost. I need more fights? I probably do. I don't. I got literally the exact number of fights. I got one too many fights. I'm always ready to split when I hit that place on the overworld. forget that I have to manage tra to traverse this hell mountain. Green banana sword? Yeah. You're not wrong.
Oh my god, stop menuing. I don't know. Good evening. Hope you're doing well. Beauty Joe, how's it going? Yeah, PC-98 Evo is a very different beast from Super Nintendo Evo. Both very good games. Just a, a very, very different player experience. And you can, you can definitely see, like, a lot of the ideas that went into the Super Nintendo game, but...
PC98 have tiling hardware? I don't know. Like, I know that PC98 was largely IBM compatible, but there was, like, some specialty stuff that set it apart from just a regular IBM compatible PC at the time. Let me drink. Thank you. Oh, this is a great, great position to be in for, for farming this area. This is fantastic. Okay. <laughs> 
yeah, the dithering work that they did in this game is just gorgeous. It's fantastic. Front to back, the artwork is amazing. to hit a thousand before we continue. That's probably too safe. Because I'm still kind of figuring out the right numbers here. and then we continue on. Yeah, the tree climbing, just fantastic. All right, so I am hurt by cold still, so let's bump you up. Marvelous. No longer a problem. Is this era terrible? No, the era is pretty, pretty good. I think. There are some lizards involved, though, that are eh, pre pretty terrible. One lizard in particular. Like, the flip side of that is that there's also one lizard that's actually pretty cool. Good, good guy. Alright, yeah, I'm in a good spot to... In a good spot to uh, farm this area now. This is great.
Oh, that's fantastic. everybody say hello to lucifer tyranno just the coolest dude just a buddy Yeah, he's great. I hope nothing bad ever happens to him. He'd fight for us. What a good friend. Ah. Goodbye, our old friend. Sweet. <laughs> 
Oh, Lucifer Tyranno was on my PB VOD just now. I'm glad to know that Lucifer Tyranno is still doing well. Devil's a jerk? Yeah. That did move me up. Oh, that's terrible. Thank <laughs> you. 
We're starting to farm now. Farm was delayed by that level up. That was a bummer. Good to know for next time. Jinpu with the raid. Welcome in, everyone. Jinpu, thank you for sharing your community with mine. Hey, everybody. I'm Tina. I play video games with a timer running. Uh, this is to give you the impression that I'm good at the video games that I'm playing. Don't be fooled. I'm not. But it is a pretty convincing trick, you have to admit. Yeah, I actually don't want to be this dinosaur. Um, I thought that I was going to evolve laterally, and I evolved vertically, which is a hindrance to the early game grind. Yeah, so for anybody who's not familiar with this, I wouldn't blame you. Uh, this is... Yonju Rokunin... Yonju Roku Okunin Monogatari V Shinkaron. For a 4.6 billion year story. V the Theory of Evolution. So that's right. This is an educational game. Get out your pen and paper. Take notes, this will be on the test. Everything that you see here is world history. Especially the dragons? Yeah, especially the dragons. The only thing you know about this game so far is you're supposed to ask me if it's Evo. So, if you're familiar with Evo, The Search for Eden, uh, known by its Japanese title, also, Yonju uh, Roku Okunin Monogatari, I forget the other half of it because it's not the Shinka run. But yeah, this this is the game that made Enix go, well, that was a neat game. We should make that for the Super Nintendo. And there's a lot of, like, there's a lot of DNA that you can definitely spot in this game. You want to evolve in real life, but you haven't murdered enough critters yet? Understandable, that's... That's, that's just one of those things that everybody has to deal with sooner or later. Let me kill you. Thank you. That's true, there is DNA all over this game.
true historical fact, vegetarians only gain experience by experiencing natural disasters. That's true. But the good news is that the higher level you are, just as a person, uh, the more experience points you get from being lit on fire, uh, having a thunderstorm strike you with lightning, uh, experiencing a volcano. Those are all worth a ton of experience points. you have additional context to help you learn the lessons that you learn from being on fire. Yeah, you got it. See, and that's, that's the type of answer that I think really comes with experience. The more experience you have, the more valuable the experience you have. It's amazing. It's time to murder seven dudes and level up. Since you started watching this, you've been pondering a Monster Hunter spinoff where you play as a monster. Yeah, actually, that sounds like it would be rad as hell. I would play that game. Assuming that it was a 2D game. So, in my PB video right now, you can see that I'm wiggling. Uh, this game, if it figures out that you are power leveling and you've moved past what is appropriate for the area, just stop spawning things. And the only way for you to amass further um, experience points, as was mentioned, is natural disasters. You just gotta wiggle until the game says, all right, I'm gonna take pity on you now. My bad early grind has put me probably behind at this point. I think that I cap out at 2k here, so I really want to be spent. See, I've lost all the time that I had previously saved. It's kind of a bummer. Oh, say lobby.
Barbarelli, how's it going? Yeah, at this point I have to get super lucky to manage to PB, which is a bummer. These are useful things to know about the routing. You're happy it's the weekend? Heck yeah. Happy weekend. That makes sense that a volcano would erupt right there. I'm not soft locked. the worst. Not the worst movement. But yeah, you get to play as Phoenix Wright. Well, Phoenix Wright's ancestor, let's be clear. Like, this is still prehistory. But this is... This is the species that will evolve into Phoenix Wright eventually. You'll see. Actually, given my current status, I'm pretty okay with these events. Not what I meant to do. How can we know what happened before history? I mean, that's a good question, but I'm going to point out. We've got the story right here. We know somehow. That's true, the land before time. We've got some good documentaries from the era. Oh, if I'm super fast, I can I can go down the right side. That's good to know. Pre 
history means it wasn't history yet. That's true. You're right. I get really lucky and I get into like no fights. Is this the, the weirdly large Hawaii? Yeah. We're on move. Oh, I see what you mean by weirdly large Hawaii. No, that's Atlantis. It's going away soon. Yeah, just normal historical events. That's correct. I would love to heal. Everybody say hello to Finland. I actually really don't want to fight any of these winged dudes. Specifically. So, like, I can... I can recover faster than they can do damage. It's just slow. No, those are those are real wings. They're not pauldrons. But I can understand why you would think that.
Okay, great. Oh, you meant on the lizard man. My mistake. Oh my god. How many elves are there here? Please go above me.
was really hoping that I could avoid him. they came up with funny fake species names for imps and elves? Why? They're real. They wouldn't be in this game if it wasn't historical. There, why is there an elf? Why is there a bonus? Why did the elf turn into a big drifle? Also, just so everybody knows, the name of the species that I just dodged a fight with Big Drifle. Like Neanderthal, but big. That's fair. I can't believe Satan top decked Force of Will. I can. It's fine, I'm playing a white deck. I'm here for the long for the long haul. Constantly staying just ahead, which not super into. There we go. This misses, I'm in really good shape. Not this one, the next one. Nope. Hatred. Destruction's next. think that I'm in the right spot for destruction.
Nope. I gotta let her do her last thing here. Good. Just don't... Nice. Alright, we win. This is gonna be the world's most pitiful PB. But oh well. That's fine. What a bummer. Gotta have a really good split here to be a sub two, which I promised everybody this was gonna be. All right, just below the mountain here is I needed to be slightly more below the mountain. It's a good boat, yeah. It's an airship. This is a JRPG. Take it easy. Devil's back. All right, just need really good RNG. That's all. everybody who came in that raid during my last run. Here's the sub two hour run that I promised you I was going to have. It's pretty mediocre, but it was less than two hours. That's true, it was a sub three again. Thank you for the GG's, everyone. Newster, Gumby, Iris, Trigonometry, Trigun, Ometry. That is such a strong handle. Ungerzak, Perpetual DM, Modafino, thank you all for the GGs. Balthazar, good to see you. Jabberwock, Nia, Dastrin, Leggy, thank you for the GGs. Yeah, I mean, realistically, I'm the only person who's who is actively running this game at this point in time. And uh, the other runs that exist use a glitch, not a glitch. You can save the game and immediately reload and it despawns all the enemies. That's not a glitch. That is how the game is explicitly programmed. Um, and it does make it faster, but it makes it, to my sensibilities, a little bit less interesting. Um, so I decided... I'll make my own category.
yeah, I think I think having to deal with whatever the RNG throws at you, either by dodging fights if you're capable or just dealing with the fights, I think that's more interesting. Yeah, it's not a glitch. It's, I mean, it's exactly how the game is meant to work. Uh, it is a anti-like... It's so that you can't put yourself in a situation where you save the game and it's literally just impossible for you to do anything now. Because most people don't play this game in a single sitting, let alone in two hours. Um, and coming back to a save game after you've put, you know, four or five, six hours into the game and go, oh yeah, I forgot. I've got two health here and I'm surrounded by enemies and there's nothing that I can do. That's a bad feeling. Yeah, it's tech. It's not it's not really cheesing. It's just it's tech that for me personally, I I don't I don't find it compelling to uh to interact with it. It's because you can get trapped between two NPCs who don't fight but do walk towards you and shout. God. Yeah. Yeah, there is there is a soft lock in the carnivore um, the carnivore uh, primate zone, which definitely sucks. If I was doing this for a marathon, I would I'd drop a save right outside of it just to make sure that I don't have anything happen there. I don't think that I don't think that there's a soft lock in the shrine that you run to um, but a couple of times I've I've been almost convinced that I had managed to get soft lock between NPCs the true speed run is library dragon Library Dragon is a good ending. I need to get a list of all the endings so that I can, like, route out what all endings would look like. I feel like that's going to be a pretty long run, so, you know, it, it would be a special, a special occasion sort of thing. We have something to celebrate or something. Yeah, all endings would be real long, but yeah, I, I think that it would be fun. And I mean, it would be like um, all endings in something like uh, like Undertale, where there's a lot of dropping saves at specific points. Just so that you can hop back to earlier points of evolution. Oh yeah, Chrono Trigger all endings. I have never actually watched a Chrono Trigger all endings run. I love the Chrono Trigger speedrun. But like, no LSS. Any percent with Manip is always fun. Um, all endings, I, I haven't been in for that long of a haul. All endings might require them all on a single save. Oh, I mean, maybe. Yeah, I, I don't know the rules for that category. Regardless, this is finally a run that is actually valid. There has been no save and load. I'm super happy about that. A drive. <laughs> 